At the beginning of the movie we notice an island with few women and children. They know nothing about what is happening around them and why. We notice a boy named Nicola who swims in the sea. He lives on an island near the sea. While swimming he sees a dead body in the sea. He comes scarily to his mother. Nicola tells mother everything and also he tells about the dead body that he saw in the sea. There was also a starfish on his belly. Listening to this his mother says that this must be a doubt. For the satisfaction of Nicola his mother gets into the sea and comes out with a starfish. She says to him that there is no dead body of the child. The same night his mother brings the dead body from the sea about which Nicola told him. When she brings the dead body of the child, many women come to her. The next morning Nicola's mother medicates him. She gives him daily. When Nicola inquires about this medicine his mother tells him that he is internally weak that's why. The next day, Nicola gets injured while swimming. Later on a nurse Stella treats him. On returning home, his mother gave him the food which was strange apparently. Nicola had to take this daily, once his mother took him to a nearby hospital. Nicola has been tested. A nurse Stella takes his blood sample. Here we know that Nicola has a habit of drawing. He draws something all the time. One day Stella sees his painting in which he has drawn a cat, giraffe building and many similar things. There was a strange thing that happened in Nicola's building, there was nothing present in the island. In this hospital Nicola has a different test daily. Now we notice the mother of Nicola along with several women island. They were eating raw seafood that was quite strange. On that night the nurses and doctors of the island watched a video. The method of surgery was being taught. The next day, we notice Nicola in a ward. There Nicola was along with a few children. They were being tested the same as Nicola was. Nicola secretly follows a nurse. His mother arrives and asks him to go home. She gives him the same medicine which he takes daily. Later on, the women of town are going to the beach. Nicola wakes up and wakes his friends too. Nicola plans to follow those women secretly to notice what they are doing there. He does so because he suspects that his mother lies to him and the rest of the women too. Now Nicola and his friend reach the sea. His friend leaves him in between. But Nicola doesn't give up. He goes towards the sea. He watches all the women in a mysterious condition there with each other. They have a strange spot on their back. We know that the women on this island are of different kinds. Nicola comes back too. The next day, his mother takes him to hospital where he has an ultrasound. The doctors tell him everything works well. Here, we know that he is a baby in his belly. Nicola was pregnant and his mother became happy upon it. Nicola comes to the same ward. On the other side, Stella was putting the newborn babies in a jar. We notice the dead friend of Nicola on a statue. He might have been pregnant and died during delivery of the baby. Afterward, Stella comes to Nicola and gives him a pen and a drawing board. So that he could paint something. We notice that there was a deep bonding between them. Both befriended each other. Nicola makes a drawing of a red-haired girl. Who is that girl? We could perceive this at the end of the story. Now a nurse enters in the ward of Nicola and lies to them that your friend has been recovered. He has sent a seashell for you. Later on, the mother of Nicola enters. She gives him that seafood to eat which he doesn't eat. She sees the drawing book. Nicola snatches the drawing book from her and she becomes angry. She asks him to ask her mother's advice. Meanwhile, Nicola says to her that she is in her mother. Nicola was brought to an operation ward. They fainted him with an injection. When he woke up he was on a bed. The rest of the children surrounded him. They say that their mother isn't their real mother. They are only bringing them up. On the other side, the nurses were watching the surgical video. Stella comes to Nicola. She gives the painting of a red-haired girl. She gives a file to Nicola. In which there were pictures of strange strained women. And the information about surgery. Now Stella brings Nicola near the sea and shows the strange marks on her back. She jumps into the sea with Nicola. Stella could breathe in the water as well. There were strange marks on her back. Nicola couldn't breathe and fainted. She brings him into senses by burning him out. When he woke up he was on his bed. At night he chases a nurse. He watches a girl in a water-filled tank. The nurse takes him from there. Later on, Nicola was put in a tank after surgery. When he wakes up he sees newborn babies. Who was stuck with him. Now Stella takes him towards the sea. Now they jump into the sea. Stella with the help of her breath takes him far away. We notice Nicola at a boat and Stella drinks him water. She watches Nicola keenly and goes back to her island. When Nicola wakes up at night, he finds him near a city. Where people like him live. Now we clear the doubts of the movie. On this island there were only adult women. And the children were all boys, no one was an adult man. Neither any young girl was there. There was a hospital in the town. Here few children were getting pregnant after medication to grow their generation. 
we have watched that Nicola's mother gave him a medicine. So, he could get pregnant. He could grow their generation. We noticed that these children were not their own. They might bring them after kidnapping them. We can analyze this with the drawing of Nicola. In that drawing, there were such things which were not present on the island. Which means Nicola doesn't belong to this island. All the children said that these are not their real mothers. Nicola was painting this because it was in his memory. The red-haired woman might be his real mother. The woman at night eats raw seafood at the beach. They couldn't eat this in front of the children. That they were bringing up. On the other side we noticed the nurses and doctors who were watching a surgical video. They watched that video so they could use these methods. When they make any mistake in surgery, the children die as the friends of Nicola are dead. Later on they threw those children into the sea. The nurses bring out the newborn babies and put them into the jar. Stella becomes the friend of Nicola that's why she provides him with a drawing board and pencil. At the end she rescued Nicola. Why has she saved him? It is a simple answer. If you all work at a secret facility and an alien is imprisoned there for an experiment. This doesn't seem good to you. You will probably help that line. If you aren't afraid. That's why the movie ends here. Thanks for watching. Do you like this type video then subscribe my channel suspense recapped.